Hello, Fisher Jenkins, and welcome to this YouTube channel. My name is Michael, and today we are going to do an Iron Dance Advanced Level class without the music, so you can see everything that is happening. I'm going to give you some tips and advices on how to teach this choreography in your Iron Dance classes. If you have any questions, comments, like I said, do it before. And if it's your first time on this YouTube channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button and the notification bell to have all the videos that you want. We have some dance musical videos, and we have some just dance tutorials like this. Where I, where I show you how to uh, have this choreography really simply and easily. I'm going to break it down a little bit. We're going to use the same pattern as yesterday. We're going to start just with some taps and then just marches. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. The same thing applies here. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Now that I have this, I'm going to just add some taps on the sides, two stones on the tap to complete my counts and to try, uh, st uh, start to map my choreography. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Great. Now that I have this, the easy part is to uh, just do a jump and a twist and add a baby mambo on the side. Easy and careful. Go. One and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Really easy pattern to do, nothing to worry about. Let's just do it one more time. One and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One and two. Four, five, six, seven, great. Now that I have this, I'm going to add a chasse and then I'm going to add two step knees. Five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Tap, tap, tap. Chasse directly. Six, two step knees. And march to complete your counts. Guys, now that you have this, let's just do it one more time to be really to be really uh, strong on our affirmations and do not to be confused. Five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight, and one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, great. Now that I have this, instead of doing just two knees, I'm going to do a step ball change and add a baby mambo. So when I start my choreography, I did a twist in baby mambo, and it's going to be really easy for my clients to know because I already did, did this movement. Okay, so when I'm doing my step ball change with a baby mambo and adding a baby mambo. It's going to be really easy for the plants to learn. So don't worry. Five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The same thing. Ta, ta, ta. Chasse. Six. Pam, pam. Go backwards. Okay? So, baby mambo, afterwards. Five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The same thing on the other side. Pa, 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 six, pa, 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 pa. Then you turn just a little bit around and march. Okay? Big mambo, turn, march, two counts. Five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. The same thing applies here. Chasse, up, go backwards, and complete with the marches. Great. Now that I have this, I'm going to just use a little bit of orientation. Okay, so instead of doing my Movement, my baby mambo, my ball change in the baby mambo there. I'm going to use my chassis to do a little bit of orientation. 
Five, six, seven, eight. One, eight, two, three, four, eight, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I have my chassis here, six here. We'll change, hop, turn around, just map and march to count it up. Okay? So I have the L approach. I'm not going to do just direct approach here, I'm going to do an L approach. Same thing applies to the other side. Five, six, seven, eight. One, eight, two, three, four, eight, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Great. Now that I have this, instead of just going to have two counts of marches, I'm going to just add some claps. I hope that it's clear for you, this approach, okay? If not, watch it carefully. The six is the count that is most important, okay? So you need to have an emphasis on this count. Five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three, four and five. Six, seven, eight and one, two, three. Four, five, six, clap, clap. One, pump, pump, chasse, turn around, here, go there, two faces, okay? Let's just do it one more time with the counts and let's speed it up a little bit. Five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight and one, two, three, four, five, six, clap, clap. One and two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight and one, two, three, four, six, five, five, ten. And then here we are done. You want one more time? Okay, just one more time for you because you're watching this video. Five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight and one, two, three. Four, five, six, clap, clap. Pound, pound, pound. Shut in. Here. Okay, go there. Clap, clap. Stage. And then, guys, you are done. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you have any questions, comments, do it below. Have a nice day, and I will be seeing you tomorrow with the next video. Bye bye.